It's hard to imagine that after 25 years of airtime and 1,200 episodes of storytelling, there wouldn't be a few mistakes. Not to mention over two dozen feature films and some of the most well-known video games ever made. Pokemon, the largest multimedia franchise in the world, has a few storylines that just don't quite work. Whether because they don't make sense or because they were just plain bad ideas, we're here to capture the moments that Pokemon caused us to question things. In the fifth feature film, Pokemon Heroes the Movie, Ash kisses a Pokemon. Well, not exactly. A Pokemon kisses Ash, we think. Basically, the movie is centered around generating Generation 3's legendary Pokemon, Latios and Latias, and Latias is apparently able to disguise herself as a human girl, which seems a bit weird already. But when the character Bianca, whose identity several characters had already called into question, kisses Ash, we aren't sure if a Pokemon has caught feelings for Ash, as the movie suddenly leaves us with a bit of a weird taste in our mouth. The next is Sabrina, the teenage psychic who turns her family into dolls so they will hang out with her. In episode 24, Ash encounters an overwhelming opponent armed with psychic type Pokemon. The battle isn't the only interesting theme in the episode, however, because upon losing Losing to Sabrina, the teenage psychic, you are also bound to the same fate as her dollified family. And for the final moment, we question the origin story of Mewtwo, a tale that was held back from English audiences for some time, probably because of Mewtwo's counterpart, a clone girl named Amber Two, who was a clone of the scientist's daughter. Throughout this short episode, we watch their time slowly come to an end, and Mewtwo, like the audience, is left with sadness at a friend's passing. Perhaps this very weighty content is why the episode wasn't brought to an English audience for so long.